Hello, Lady Santa. Hello, my darling. <laughs> uh, welcome, everybody, to day 24 of Proven 2022. Aww. Um, I know, right? Hi. It goes so quickly. Uh, one beer till Christmas. <laughs> Uh, so our so final day, we are going to try a beer. We're going to rate a beer. We're going to give a beer reindeer. Mm -hmm. And it's the last obligation reindeer have before they go to your house. We don't want to tax them over exactly. much. Exactly. So yeah, we're good. what do you got, kiddo? Well, I had to cover it with a stocking because I'm wearing the Santa hat, but... <gasps> what do you got? Oh, an Allagash Nocturna, which means... Night, which means Eve. Eve. <gasps> wow. Total coincidence, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Total coincidence. Hundred percent is. But Allagash, I really like. Um, Nocturna, I have not had this. I'm assuming that it is really, really black. Oh, it's not super black. No, not as dark as I expected, but um, but still like but, a very robust color. Yeah. Now, what is it though? So it's a Nocturna bourbon barrel aged stout with vanilla. Oh, these are a few of my favorite things. Um, not a lot of st ahead on that. Want are to try you sure for the day? final evening? Go for it. My Dickensian delight. Not looking, not cheating. Okay, I smell the bourbon barrel aging. That's always very telltale. It's quite rich smelling, a little vanilla. What are you thinking, my dove? I'm thinking I need just another. All right, let's step. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah? Because I wasn't really tasting the vanilla, mm -hmm. and then I let it just kind of linger in my mouth for a moment, and mm -hmm. then it just goes. That's lovely. Yeah, that's really nice. That's really nice. Not overwhelming, mm -hmm. not an afterthought. It's just really blended beautifully. Um, it's got. You know, it's just a really nice stout with that little bit of, um, you know, a, a bourbon smokiness to it mm -hmm. um, from the barrel aging. Um, vanilla just gives it a nice little rounded finish. Oh, it's lovely. Yeah. It doesn't have the smooth creaminess that I'm, in terms of the effervescence that I'm used to with the stout, but I don't really care. Um, it's, you know, it's wonderful as it is. Yes, I agree. I absolutely agree. Um, it is interesting because because we don't often see vanilla as a featured flavor, like at least in the description. Yeah. And it's it really works beautifully with the other flavors. Yeah, it really rounds it out. Um, interesting. Like I my my go to from Allagash is the Allagash White. Um, and so oh, yes, true. Get a very specifically, particularly dark was a surprise. But I think they nailed it. Um, we'll learn a little bit more about it when I'm in better light. Uh, <laughs> I really can't see that label right now. Um, what are you thinking in terms of reindeer for this lovely ale? It, it really is. It's delicious. And, and I think... We may finish it before the video's I over. It's absolutely true. And that is very telling. So here's where I'm... I mean, I'm giddy <laughs> that we're done. Do I want to... Uh, oh, dear. No, um, go go for it. All right. Uh, do, do I give it a solid seven because it it merits a seven, or because I'm giddy and happy that Ruben is done? Is it an eight? I don't know if it's exceptional enough for an eight. What are you? You know, this is there's no, absolutely nothing wrong with yeah. this. Um, I don't want to kill a reindeer on the night before uh, Christmas, so um, we can let's... come to an agreement. Let's go for the seven. You want to go eight? I. Let's go eight. I'm I'll tell you why. Um, <laughs> the, the, because I keep reaching for it, and each time I sip it, I taste something else. I should. There's coffee check that. in there. There's a little bit of chocolate in there. There's a little bit of vanilla, and it's all blended so beautifully. And I mean, look at this. We're almost like we're finishing this. That's really beautiful. That's really good. Um, I think it's really. Each sip, I'm discovering something else. Um, the 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 aroma is fantastic. Uh, again, it's it's just a it's just a really good one. Mm -hmm. It's also 9.5 percent, which is why I went. Oh, it does not taste like it. It doesn't. That's oh. dangerous. <laughs> Guys, read your labels. This will wow. knock you out of your sleigh. This is 
Yeah. Yeah. This has got some po I'm really glad it's not one of those Imperial pints. Oh my goodness. This would I knock me on my dare. ass and I wouldn't even see it coming. Yeah. Um, this is like the Conor McGregor, uh, but not a dick. Of, 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 sorry. Uh, are we cutting that? Nah. Um, Merry Christmas. Uh, so, uh, okay, so we're going eight reindeer? Yes, I think eight so. Eight reindeer for Allagash Nocturna. Well done, Allagash. Oh, holy I'm Proud nice. of you. Um, so, uh, until next year, hopefully we'll be doing this again. Uh, yeah, but before we finish Go. up, I just want to give a shout out to the places that we shop for beers this year, um, including our local breweries that we haven't already shouted out. But um, Beverage Plus on South Street here in Warwick, lovely humans. Craft Beer Cellar on Main Street in Warwick, again, the most wonderful people. And uh, for the first time, newly opened Beer World in Chester. Um, all of these in New York, of course. Uh, so check them out. Give them your beer business. Place I want to live on a beer world. All right. Uh, yes, they're really, they were all really good to us too. Yeah. Just lovely people. Um, so uh, until we meet again next season, I've been Don. That's been Kelly. And cheers. cheers. Merry Christmas, friends. Happy holidays. And Happy New Year.